And cilantro is also known for regulating blood pressure. Or no, blood cholesterol. That's actually supposed to be kale. So don't forget that little snippet. Of course, sad thing is you can't add it. It's too strong. Too much. You can't add too much. Okay, so now we're going to begin mixing. Make sure your thing is secure. Your top. Make sure your top is secure. You don't want it flying everywhere. And you also... Oh, that's crunchy. You also... You also just don't want it to... Um, just to not... Yeah, you just don't want to fly it anywhere. Okay, so usually I start off with the blend. But sometimes I want to crush it first because the celery, like I told you before, is so freaking rough. Like, it... It just makes it harder. So it's gonna be pretty loud. Um right, so. now the water is working. Yeah, the water is doing work because if you didn't put too much water, it it still be very dry. You can tell that you put it about right here, about right here, and there's a lot of good Okay, unlike a lot of people, because I've seen this, a lot of people just keep going. A lot of people just keep going and waiting until it goes all the way down. I like to be on my uh, smoothie, all the step, all the steps. Like I like to be with it when it's kind of done, when it's not done. I just like to be there when it's just not perfect. It's fun because you get to see, you get to like kind of like uh, you, you like dictate how it like comes out. Because usually people just kind of stand there and go, hmm, 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 and everything like that. And I'm just like, so you're not going to show us how it'll look when it's not even finished yet? Or, you, okay. And you, you just get a little curious. So I'm just going to show you every step of the way. It's fine. That way. All right. Here is some Chobani yogurt. I got it in plain. Right here. Um, it's very protein. This is the main reason I'm putting it in. It's the protein value of this. It has more protein than the average protein shake. It's crazy. And that's because it's just plain yogurt. You're not adding any other things like that. So you won't get the value from it like you usually would. So it's crazy. I, I love it. Of course, I wouldn't eat it by itself because it's kind of disgusting. But shoot. I mean, put it in there to get your nutritional value as much as possible. This is what. This is why you're making a green smoothie to get your value from it. Make sure the spoons clean. Go back to it. Oh, I got some on it. Make sure you clean that after yourself because you don't want to do it later. This is how it will look like when there is nothing else in there. And this is not where you want to eat it. This is when you add your fruit. I don't really look up fruit health benefits because it's just fruit. It's more of mostly a sweeter. No one really goes into how the you know how the fruit benefits you because fruit's kind of just there to make everything sweeter. That's basically what it is. If you put a lot of blueberries in here, it's gonna turn purple. It's really cool. I think I'm gonna make it turn purple just to show you. And if you notice, it's a little bit, it's a little bit liquidy for my taste, so I might go back in there with the kale. Yeah, it's a little liquidy for my taste, so I might go back in the kale. I probably to put too much water, which is fine. It's all about kind of figuring out what you like, what you want in it. It's not more. It's not more about oh it has to be perfect and all that stuff like that because there's no such thing as a perfect green smoothie you're gonna run into a few bumps in the road and that's why it's, it's fine to keep adding plus kale is just it so you're gonna add it anyway 